you? Okay. What's up with you, man? How you living, man? How you living, man? Indeed, man, indeed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, hey, man, for everybody who don't know, man, please, in the, hey, please introduce yourself for the audience, man. Hey, this is Josh Howard checking in at SportsCon. Indeed, man, indeed, brother. So, hey, man, so, hey, how you enjoying the atmosphere out here, brother? Man, it's lit. It's pretty dope, man. It's the first time out here, man. It's good to see all these people out here. Man, my first time out here, too, man. First time out here, too, man. Yeah, definitely dope. Hey man, they just threw me, hey, they right, they said they threw Henny in the blender, man. I pulled us to support my boy and then he got me running the damn show. Hey, no, <laughs> Sometimes you gotta step up. Hey, it be like that though, man. Yes, sir. It be like that though, man. So like, hey, so what sport did you play and how long did you play it, man? Um, I played professional basketball. Um, I didn't start playing until like my sophomore year of high school. Mm -hmm. um, but I didn't take it serious until like my last two years of high school. So let me ask you, you look like somebody named Josh Howard, man. That is me. Man, <laughs> I thought I was crazy, Ken, but I couldn't hear you at first, man. It's all good. Hey, man, I'm a diehard Dallas Mavericks fan, man. Just like, what is your favorite postseason uh, memory, man? Uh, probably when we made it to the finals in 06, even though we didn't win. Just being able to do that in Dallas for the first time, and it, it was just like a blessing to be around a team like that. Josh Howard, This Josh Howard, boy. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, bro. So yeah, that, that was the that was one of my fondest post uh, postseason memories. Man, real talk, man. So hey, matter of fact, hey, I'm gonna let you ask the next question, man. I ain't just gonna hog you. Yeah, I'm from man. Dallas, man. So I know Josh Howard, man. Same. <laughs> Wild man style, you go hard though, you yeah, know what man, I'm saying? Hey, people be forgetting about Josh Howard, man. Flow, bro. Yeah, we know who you are, man. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. I just, I played with love, man, and I love the city of Dallas, man. So, they always showed me support, man. Yeah, appreciate that, man. And that's why I'm still here to this day. Yeah, appreciate yeah, that, man. Yeah, appreciate that, man. So, I wanted to ask you, like, the Cowboys, man. Yeah. You know, Cowboys got a lot of talent, man. Yeah. You know, Dak Prescott, what you think the Cowboys go do, man? Like, just support them on the outside. Like, what's your thoughts on them? Well, I'm definitely a Cowboys fan, and I think they're going to do better than what they did last season. Yeah. Um, I think yeah. the expectations is high, but I think these guys understand what they got to do to win. Yeah. Um, and it's, the biggest thing is just playing great in the postseason and, um, and trusting your teammates. So yeah. I think with all the adversity they've been through in the past, I think this year and next year could be the year that we really take it to the top. Yeah, because you've been on a, like a championship level squad, and I remember like, first of all, I want to say this as a person that's born and raised in Dallas, y'all got cheated, bro. Yeah. <laughs> They yeah. finesse y'all, man. Yeah, was, can can we rough. talk about that, man? Oh, yeah, yeah. Y'all got cheated, bro. <laughs> I took my dad to the game, bro. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I remember I took, uh, and them tickets going up with three Gs. Yeah, yeah, it was expensive. I didn't want to see us get cheated, bro. Yeah. And, and the way they had Wade on that line, come on, man. He <laughs> shot like 30 free throws game. game. Yeah, I mean, he shot more free throws, but you got you, you, you still got to give him credit because they definitely, you know. I'm not giving him no credit, bro. <laughs> no, I'm not. Hey, I was heartbroken for years. I'm mad, bro. Yeah. I'm still mad at that, bro. We should have got, y'all should have got one, yep. and then we should have got another one in 2011. Yeah, I agree with then you. Then y'all quit. We set the, the tone for 2011. Y'all did, though. Y'all did, though. So. Yeah. And see that team, people sleeping. Y'all be Phoenix, bro. Oh, yeah. In the game seven, y'all be San Antonio. Yeah. I remember that yeah. whole run, bro. Like, yeah. so it was like, like a passing of the torch, man. And see, it's and see, they had more squad in 2011, but I think y'all had more heart. Yeah. Yeah, I'm agree with y'all. Y'all wasn't that deep. Y'all yeah. wasn't that deep. Yeah, we just played about eight deep, and we, yeah. we played hard. Yeah, 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 bro, yeah, like, yeah so. man. Now, I agree with y'all on that, man. But just to see, like I say, Dallas in the, in the basketball world get a championship, was, it was awesome because yeah, nobody yeah. was expecting the Mavs to ever win no time soon. No, no. man. Oh. Hey, but how did it feel to get that monkey off your back being San Antonio, man? Ooh. Oh, yeah, it was a big monkey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we, we got it off, man, but like hats off to them, man, because they made us who we were as far as like the competitive nature, um, same, similar type of talent, uh, great coaching. So um, we took a page out of their book and, you know, just ran with it on our own type of style. I got to flip this a little bit back to the Cowboys scene okay. because we've been in a slump since 27. Ooh. But the Mavericks was in a deeper slump, bro. Yeah. The Mavericks, they used to give away them tickets. I heard. <laughs> but then when y'all came, one of the things I heard is that Mark Cuban uh, really changed the coach. He said they start treating y'all first class. He yeah. started saying that they start giving y'all first class flights and first class trips. Yeah. They changing uniform. Yeah. Like, how much culture got to do with, like, 
like like leadership from the top and, and really just transform it to championships and making it to championships. It, it's the top. It's the top as far as culture is concerned. Um, uh, making the players feel like they're, they're needed or wanted and then also having the community aspect, man. The community, yeah, really? Yeah, yeah, I think the community played a big part as, as far as like the support they show. Yeah. Um, a, lot of, a lot of people outside don't realize that that that, 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 that means a lot to the athletes. So, man, you heard that? So, so Indeed. Being able, being able to have the community behind you pushes you to play even harder. Listen up, listen up. Indeed, man. But, hey, man, we appreciate you for stopping through and showing love, man. Man, man, y'all keep doing your thing. Indeed, man. Brother. I appreciate you personally, man. I'm, I'm personally glad to meet you finally, bro, because you was one of my favorites on that squad. Man, I appreciate it that, was man. the way you played, bro. You yeah. really did play fast. I say wild wow, man not being disrespectful. Yeah. I say wild wow, man on how you oh, played. Yeah, yeah, no yeah, 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 yeah. We know your style, bro. You was you you was up and down that floor, yes, and then you wasn't What's even like on? a top draft guy. You was the last pick in the first round. Huh? That was the last pick in the first round. Yeah, so but anyway, bro, man, nice right, to meet bro. you. Out. Same here, man. Y'all be good. Indeed, brother. Hold it down, bro. Man, that was dope, man. I sat down with Howard. That's dope, man. Let's